in there. But what do you mean? Oh, true. He'll get it. He'll get it. We got the right names on the on the people. White Peach versus Squeak. This is the real thing. Squeak, as you said, coming in with that dare. Oh my god, he's got to watch out for that though. I know he's probably going to end up getting scooped up by that one time. Taking Max D from trying to cross cancel it. So. Oh, my White Peach made an excellent roll there, but really didn't get a good punish off of it. Alright. That's a nice little combo here going on. They're actually a good use of the drill rush. Got the pop out, so we got a safe landing. Oh, oh she just, I just walked right into that one. That's unfortunate. Alright, so Squeak's caught, catching the kind of reaching right now with this uh, Toad. But there you nice. go, good punish. I think she could have got a little more than that had she dared him. And, yeah. But it's all good. She, she's she's definitely playing a little bit timid. She's starting to make a, mount a little comeback right there, but Squeak just go ahead and cut that stock straight off. Yeah, she, was, she definitely there. got fooled by the down B fake out. Yeah. Oh, that was a stitch. Just missed it there. And she, I think she's right now she's respecting Squeak, uh, Squeak a little too much because the way she usually plays, she's very aggressive. And right now it doesn't seem like she's trying to be too aggressive. Yeah, and I'd imagine that JC probably gave her some advice in the matchup, so she's probably trying to apply the matchup advice she got, but also play her, play her style, so it's a little, probably a little conflicting at first. Yeah. All right. Well, Squeak managing to uh, hold this lead quite well. Oh, okay, a little reach right there, but no punish. Oh, all right, well, he got a, a weak punish on that one. Yeah, that'll do it. So close to even game, a down smash could make it an even one. Oh, nice, nice read on the roll. Sweet. And a little bit of damage. Oh, God, again. Ooh, and she's done. She's, she's got to stop rolling into this, man. He keeps doing the... Uh, she, the, the this is what, what's weird, though. She's getting punished the same way but not adjusting. And so yeah. Squeak doesn't need to adjust to do exactly. it. He can keep doing it. And, you know, that's that's something that can really get you against players. Like, if you, you adjust before they've adjusted to you, it can actually hurt you very badly. You give away all of your techs, and you give them a chance to counter your moves. All right, let's see if she can uh, pull this one back. Right now, Squeak has landed so many F smashes in, a, in the span of one game. So and bears, and she she's really she's she's got to get some space on it, and she doesn't have a good option to bear, so she's got to bait it out and wait for it. Oh, okay. She, I feel like she like one frame ducked that. Like <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Alright, oh no. Squeak just, he's playing safe. He, he, he's literally just ho hopping over and, until she fake, until she sells out and then he's just getting hit in. Mm. She she's got enough time to punish on the uh, on the up or the down B fake out, but to be, I, I think that's a thing with a lot of people is like when they see the down B, they just automatically assume they're going to get hit, so they just hold shield anyway. Yeah, you got it. You, and sometimes you have to respect it. It's very risky to, to try and make that punish because if you, if you call it wrong, you're going to die at, at an early percent. Right. All right. Oh, nice. Still living. Actually, have to turn around so I can grab the ledge and stuff. Yeah, I just I like Speaks play. He's not. He's not really over committing to anything. He's just kind of waiting for White Beach to move. And oh, and that was a ledge grab moment, but she did not. Yeah, she almost had that. She would have had to reverse hover there. She has a stitch, I believe. Oh, the miss. Grab the stitch. Oh, misses yeah. the grab. And this. Oh, that could have been the demise right there. Almost. Very small blast zones over here. Not. Uh, did not kill, but uh, I don't think Evans gonna sweat it too much, and he doesn't. So uh, a JV3 on the on the first game. That was a lot of rolls for uh, for uh, like no reason at all. She wasn't really in no imminent danger as she rolled toward him. So that was I'm kind of wondering. Maybe it's just nervous nervous roll, you know. Definitely. Or yeah, you could, it could be bad habits. But Squeak Squeak didn't really have. I mean, he just kind of jumped over and waited for it to happen, waited for things to happen, and he was able to get his move. She wants to change, bring this around. She's gonna have to uh, bait those bait those bears out. They're hard. They're hard for Peach to just straight up move versus move to win. Okay. Wow. Right. Put Max D <laughs> on that shield. Some tabs. A a a a a a a a. Mash Queen right there. Like, oh. I'm trying to get Just to miss. Ooh, I like the up. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. If that had killed him, oh, she can get it back. Not going to. Right, see, if that would have killed, that would have definitely been on the reel. She, she would have deserved that one. 
Oh, and she, she tried to do a little razz pizzazz and that didn't work out for her there. That would have looked real nice, though. It would have. Ooh, all right, there's a little. Oh, the reverse? The reverse? And does the reverse give you a stronger hit? No. Um, he just happened to be turning around. It, the, the strongest hit is uh, if you let it go all the way. White so it doesn't matter if it, you reverse it or not. Gotcha. It's just you have to let the whole thing run. Well, White Peach was able to get the kill, but unfortunately she blew her jump in, in canceling her Nair and ended up costing her that second stock. So now she's down a whole stock. Oh, no. The way she played on the first stock, she could bring this back. but Yeah, but she's got to she's let, not let this fly. Oh, right there. Squeak with a very nice edge guard. She's got to not let this fluster, but it seems like Squeak's pretty much got this in the bag right now. He's playing up solid. He's playing right now. He's, I'm not even sure if he's playing matchups or if he's playing all straight fundamentals right now, but it seems like he's doing a, a little bit of both. Playing the uh, I don't need to approach you game because I'm ahead. So. Yep, definitely. And when you're Peach down two stocks, you're gonna, you lose the ability to crouch cancel down smash, and that really sucks. Cool. All right. So he tried to crouch cancel that. He's getting body for it, but. You know, uh, I've been told a lot, a lot of times it's actually better to crouch cancel at high, a higher percentage because sometimes that will save you. It'll definitely save you if you get hit by like an up smash or something. That's oh, no, no, I'm talking about uh, Peach is down. Uh, oh, right. Yeah. It won't, you won't get hit back into it or comboed off of it. You can take Ooh, it free. It. So just a little bit better than she did the last game, but two two-stock victories for Squeak. And he'll move on to the next round, likely against Gimmer. As we uh, await our next our next match.